Hey everyone, hey dear brothers and sisters in Jesus Christ. Today is another new day. Today is the day the Lord has made. Maybe someone will get saved. Keep looking up, brothers and sisters. It is the whole world that is biblical. And I know I say these things often. I repeat myself and show very similar things, but it's not me doing the repetition. It's them doing the repetition. I hope and pray this helps open people's eyes to the reality of the world. It's not a good place. There are nice things here, but today's the day of salvation. If you don't have salvation in Jesus Christ alone, I would pray that you really look into that. Read the Bible for yourself. Try and research and study the meaning of life, the truth. And you'll find, honestly, that Jesus is the way, the truth, the life. He died on the cross, shed his precious blood, was buried, then resurrected three days later. According to the scriptures, that's the gospel to get saved. We're all sinners in need of a Savior. Jesus Christ is the only Savior. So it's the whole world. It's even in India. Here's an actress from India, Deepika Patakon. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right, but the quick little bit of Google info here says that She's an Indian actress who works predominantly in Hindi films. She is one of the highest paid actresses in India, right? So she's a highly paid, she has fame, fortune, and success. How does that happen? Naturally, with God-given talents? Or is it people doing the vow of silence, keeping the secret of the biblical world? It's not such a secret anymore, but a lot of people are blind to the reality of the world they live in. Keeping the secret of the biblical world about fame, fortune, and success and how it really works and most likely, or most definitely, about Freemasonry. I will show you with a couple more pictures. She's seen here doing meditation. Yoga and meditation are very popular nowadays. They seem to be getting more popular. They are both things that Christians and everyone should actually stay away from. When you do meditation, I used to do meditation in different ways. I thought it would connect me with God and raise my consciousness and raise my vibration. That is very new age. That is very mystery school, mystery religion, old religion. There's nothing new under the sun. We should meditate on the words of God. We should meditate in a way that's not opening ourselves up to de demons and like aligning our chakras and awakening our chakras and all these things. There is some truth in that stuff, but God warns us to stay away. And we can see all the sellouts do this stuff, it seems, right? They have all the hand gestures. They push the satanic agendas. They do things like yoga and meditation. She is hanging out on the Freemason checkerboard. Hmm. A little hard to tell here, but she's dressed up, hiding her hand in her coat or her dress or whatever. The way a Freemason would do. Don't believe me? She is hiding her hand in her coat the way a Freemason would do. This one is much more clear to see. They usually grab one side of the coat and shove the other hand in there, making it very obvious that this is the hidden hand. The, the, she's a master of the second veil, and there's no master of anything. Freemasons and all their garbage talk. It's the Freemason hidden hand. Why are they doing this? Because they love Jesus Christ in truth? Or are they working with the occult, the esoteric? Something that only a few people really know and understand, but more Christians are waking up to this. I hope it helps put the fear of God in people when they go, the world has been deceiving us on a massive scale about what the earth is, about what fame and fortune is about, about success, quote unquote, in this world. Right? All of our entertainment... It seems to be sold out. And you must use discretion and discernment when you watch television or take part in things. Brothers and sisters and everyone else, I hope you can see that the biblical world, it's the whole world like this. The Freemason connection, it's the whole world. The God of Freemasonry is Lucifer the light bearer. We know him as Satan, the father of lies, the enemy of God, the enemy of Christians, the enemy of everyone, in fact. God bless you, everyone.